we have a big, massive mismanagement with the water in Iraq. There is more than 80% of our water coming from our neighbor country, and there is no clear vision how to moderate the water. All around the world, the average of using the water per day around 150 liter. In Iraq, we pass 300 liter per day per person. And we need to decrease this number, of course, uh, and especially with the agricultural area, we need to use the new methodology of irrigation systems. And we don't know if there is rain this year or not. If there is no rain and there is no water from Turkey and Iran, that means we don't have drinkable water next year for the people who's living in Iraq. This is me, I'm Salman Khairallah. I'm executive director of Humad Dijla and co-founder. Humad Dijla, which means Tigris River Protectors Association. We call ourselves Social Environmental Movement. We work in an almost 17 city in Iraq with around 400 volunteers. And we are focusing on water and environment and cultural heritage. We are delighted that we are working with the CCFD from 2019 till now. And through the support of the CCFD, we start creating a new connection, getting more uh, donation to start doing more uh, projects. The documentation in general is really important for all kind of our work. There is a saying says, it's show me, don't tell me. The photographer will help us a lot to just showing the people inside Iraq and outside Iraq what's going on exactly. At the same time, it's giving you the positivity, which is that there is hope. Because in the end, there is hope.